Welcome back handbag lovers. This is a requested video of what's in my Kipling backpack. This is in the pretty green color. And the monkey's name is Nora. This backpack has one two, three pockets, no back pockets, and these comfortable shoulder straps that are padded. So I took this into the office today and I'm going to show you what it is that I packed. In this first pocket, I have my house keys and my car keys. That's what's in there. And I also put my cell phone in there. Today I wore a fashion scarf, but I got a little hot so I just took it off, and this is it. Then in this little pocket, I have a Sephora compact mirror. A chapstick. hand sanitizer, liquid, Kleenex, a hand lotion, a notepad, And this pouch that I purchased from Dollar Tree. And here I have some gum. A bar. Floss and four mints. So that's like my little snack refreshment pouch. The very last pocket in the back is one that I'm not that I didn't reach for and I don't intend to unless I really need it but I carry what I may need when I'm away from home for a long period of time so if on my break I feel like I want to read a book I finished reading the wicked one for the first not for the first time and then this is the uh, volume two of The Wicked Years. Then here I have my Louis Vuitton Sarah wallet in the old model. And then my sunglasses. This back zip compartment. I have two ginger chews. They're good for um, when I'm getting feel nauseated. A cute hair clip. A hair tie. A necklace that I was going to wear and I forgot to put it on. And the last thing in this compartment are the tags from the backpack and how much I paid for it at TJ Maxx, which was $40. 
I've seen this backpack at a bookstore actually and it was priced at a hundred dollars so I got a good deal and the last thing on here is my Louis Vuitton dupe that I purchased from Amazon a couple years ago you might be able to find these on this on eBay not on Amazon because Amazon pulled a lot of these items out but here it is it's a toiletry pouch and it does have a handle here and I attach this bag charm that I purchased from eBay quite some time ago I'm not going to put everything that I have here because if you have seen my videos before you know what are the contents of this bag I would just give you a quick look in this houses the things that I could potentially need when I'm away from home for a long time such as when I go into the office so here I have bathroom spray self-explanatory uh, I have a tight to go pin band-aids extra set of headphones band um, a nail file a clean pair of undies, feminine products, a army Swiss knife, headache inhaler, a Lysol spray, um, a, an emergency floss because that is not my floss of choice but that's just in case I really need it. Um, eye drops, mouthwash, Tums, and cold medication. So like I said, this is actually pretty heavy because I have it stuffed with so many things. But I only take this with me when I'm going to be into the off be in the office. And this is just going to be sitting in my desk locked away. So I don't have to worry. It doesn't matter if it's heavy because it's just going to be sitting there. I'm not going to be carrying it all day. If I'm going to be going grocery shopping or to the store, I'm not taking this with me. I would just pull out essential items that I could potentially need, like Tylenol, Advil, perhaps a Band-Aid. And I do carry um, some um, wipes, like bathroom wipes, but those I keep in my desk at work. That way I don't have to keep packing them back and forth if I'm going to be going somewhere else other than the office and I do take wipes with me and alcohol wipes as well to disinfect everything that I I make my own and I wipe down the carts when I go to the grocery store. Um, and hand sanitizer, I use a spray one that I also have in my desk at, at the office. And um, my I also have in here disposable masks. They're in the back somewhere here at the bottom. Um, but yeah, thank you for the request and I hope you enjoyed watching this.